able to do this. We hope all of you enjoy the nativity play presented by us, little ones of the pre-family section. So, stay calm and be ready to revive your memory as we go back thousands of years ago and bring to you God has chosen you. I am the Lord Jovic, which happened to me as you have said.
when Joseph and Mary came to Bethlehem, it was late at night, and they were very tired. They reached an inn and knocked at the door. The innkeeper opened the door. You will find a baby 
Reb in a cloth and lying in a manger.
Mr. Clemente, our manager, all the teachers, and uh, to you, my dear children. So, as uh, as I have seen, uh, you know that uh, the program that you have put on, and I want to know from the class one children, those who are watching, did you watch the play? Yes. Okay. Is it about is it about what? The birth of Jesus. Class one. Class one. And then uh, who is the mother of Jesus? And who is the father of Jesus? Joseph. And who came to visit Jesus? The three, the three what? The three, the three kings. Santa also came at the end. The three kings also came, and then the shepherd, and then the drama boy. Did you all see that? Then you have the angels, and then you have the children who came with the gifts, and you have the children who are dancing. So they are all here. So Christmas is about the birth of Jesus, isn't it? Yes, and then so everyone, everyone can go to visit Jesus, okay? Whether it is with gifts or without gifts, because the drama boy didn't have anything at all. The drama boy just went only with the song and the drum, and he's a poor drama boy. But Jesus is happy with him, okay? So. Whatever you have with you, whether it is gifts or no gifts, you can always go to Jesus. Is it? Yes or no? Yes. yes. Okay, and I am so happy with the KG children who have put out the nativity play. Congratulations to all of you. And when I come to the class, I am so happy to see all of you. And now I am more happy to see you here on the stage. And say thank you to your parents. And when you go home, say thank you to your parents as well, okay, for preparing you all. And thank you to the teachers, and thank you to the teachers who have taken so much trouble. Okay, and the message of this Christmas season, let it be, that you can go to Jesus at any time, and let there be love in your family, and among you, among children, okay, and help one another. And love one another in the classroom and everywhere because it is Christmas season. Okay? And you continue that all throughout the year. Isn't it? Yes or no? Yes. yes. So will you be good this Christmas season and all throughout the year? Yes. Okay? So thank you so much to all of you. And then I know something else also is waiting on the ground. So have a good time today and enjoy yourself. And a very happy Christmas to all of you. And wish your parents also when you go home. Okay? So thank you so much. Sister already spoke to you about baby Jesus. A baby Jesus for me is a very good gift. God gave his own son and he is the love. Right? So you must learn how to love each other. You did very well here. Beautifully you came without disturbing others. You learned every word what man taught you. Beautifully you are here on the stage as you were in the classroom. Alright? Well done children. And class one will have now on the 21st maybe taking part in Nativity Play. Christmas is something to not only to celebrate but to enjoy and to share. Share our love, share what we have with the people who do not have. Jesus came as a babe, helpless. He was helpless like you. Little ones came to the nursery class. Mama had to hold your hand, ma'am has to hold your hand. So Jesus also came like a little babe, helpless. But he grew. 
in wisdom, like you are going to grow. Now next year you'll be in class one, then in two, three, then twelve, then you'll become a grown-up person. To do what? To good. Good to people. Good to neighbors. Good to all our friends, parents, elders. All those who do not have home, do not have things to live on. Alright? So the spirit is Jesus in your home when you are making a little Christmas tree. Don't think of only Santa. Santa we always want to see something. Right? But we think of God coming to us. Alright? So that we live in love and peace and joy. So wish you a Merry Christmas. I know you are having a longer holidays, babies, class nursery and KG and you're having a good celebration today. Be good at home with your parents, with your neighbors, with your friends and share your love and joy. God bless you children. Thank you once again teachers for preparing them so well. Give them a loud applause. Come on. The children, I was more watching the children at the mic. That is wonderful. They learned their part. They articulated every word. Excellent. A special thanks to our teachers. Give them a loud a clap to the corner teachers. Who go to train them. But the children remain innocent and happy and joyful. God bless you. Merry Christmas to all of you. Thank you, sister. Louder. On behalf of the and the I thank God for making it possible for us to present rather than the native to play before I love you. I also thank the Sir Arby and Sister Clementine for spending their valuable time and being present with us this morning. I thank everyone present here today. And we hope you enjoy your day ahead as much as you are making it enjoyed. Have a great day.